Hey guys, Unfrequented World, out detecting, it just poured rain, I'm back at the lake, I've only dug a couple holes here in the top park, nothing but junk so far, so until we get something good, you're not going to hear from me again. Actually I lied, I wanted to show you guys, I did figure out how to uh, save your, your uh, settings. So if you click on the options button, then you go down to save, whatever you have set up, like your gain and your discrim. If you push the plus arrow, it goes to save. Then you have to hold, hit the select button, and it will actually save the settings. So you can turn the machine off and back on, and it will remember those settings. So it's raining pretty good now. I'm hiding under this big tree, but uh, the only reason I came out was to get the cruiser cleaned off today anyway, so that's all good. I'll just let the rain do its thing. Well, 45 minutes in, and you guys aren't missing anything yet. So this is where I found the first and only ring of the uh, year so far, guys. That nice little silver. And look at the grass. It's only been uh, two weeks. And uh, it's pretty much undetectable. And the rain is starting again. That's right, clean that baby off. Well, first coin of the night, just a penny. Well, that stunk. I guess sometimes it takes more than one outing to make a video. Well, as you guys can see, it is still pouring rain out. And it's not going to stop today. It's supposed to go all day. So I've decided to clean some of my finds. And I'll show you guys those now. I've also saved these pieces here, which I want to do um, some electrolysis on. Part of an old sign that uh, does have writing on it. Just haven't had time to get to it yet, but soon we're going to do that. And in an upcoming video, we'll take a look. Some people would be disheartened that it's raining and they can't go out detecting, but I had work to do that I've been putting off, and uh, we're going to do it. We're going to wash the uh, detectors today. You know, it's just one of those things that's kind of a pain in the butt to do, um, especially with the AT Pro, because you got to take the uh, receiver-transceiver unit for... You know, that that's a lot of work right there. Whew, I don't know, I've just been putting it off for so long that... Then we have to take, you know, each detector... This is a part I don't like because there are a lot of mosquitoes out here. We put it in the washing machine like that and uh, it's on delicate right now so that's okay. So that's the first one. The new cruiser, part of the reason I upgraded was that you don't have to mess around with those uh, transceivers and stuff for the headset. It's just too much work to take them off when you gotta wash them and move them and you know. There we go. And uh, we'll leave these in the washing machine for about an hour. So we'll just let those soak. You'll also see that's how I wash the four-wheeler too. I'm bored, okay? It's raining. I, I can't get out detecting. I have nothing better to do so you can't blame me. I tried guys. I tried. 